focus as market leader is been for us to grow the EV market, you know, to grow the pie, uh, grow EV penetration into the Indian automotive space. That is that is the number we really focus on. You know, what percentage of the Indian auto total industry volume uh, has the EV uh, volume penetrated into? Today we are still around the two percent mark, and we need to grow that. And as market leader, uh, we don't have the luxury of eating market share from others. Uh, we have to grow the market. And um, what I said earlier in terms of driving adoption, using a lot of, uh, you know, the fundamental actions on the ground, uh, that has been uh, our primary focus, and that's the number we focus on. In terms of, of the EV transition, uh, despite the fact that we've seen growth taper in the, uh, in the last uh, 12 months, the trajectory is uh, is very much, uh, we believe, a trajectory that will uh, will uh, uh, determine a uh, a full EV uh, future. We do not see any compromise in the uh, in the directional shift that is uh, is being undertaken uh, by the industry. Public charging network in India is still uh, not up to the mark, and it is picking up. While I say there is tremendous efforts being done. But uh, the availability, uh, the uptime of these charging stations are at a risk of uh, uh, giving a threat to the electric mobility. Uh, uh, but I believe that this is at a very, very nascent and initial stage. Uh, there are many startups and many IoT based uh, or new generation uh, startups which are coming and disrupting this market by in terms of technology. Some models have been pushed out. Uh, not only in, in, in Europe, but also in the US, that's true. But at the same time, if you look at where the investments are going, the investments are going towards plug-in hybrid and mild hybrid. I think the battery chemistry will also change over a period of time. And the way we fuel um, uh, the vehicles, not just through gasoline, but also hydrogen can become uh, a, a source, which would be a cleaner source uh, towards powering, powering the engines. Uh, so net-net, to answer your question, um, there will be progress towards electrification, but it's not just going to be purely 100% uh, battery electric vehicles.